we have here an example maybe of green architecture, we are not sure, but in any case, look at this beautiful green area that they have made in order to provide shade for the people in the coffee shop. Hi friends, I want to show you this area which we choose. There are many advertisements here. You can see all along the road, both above and below. They are too much and too big. And it's not about sustainable cities as they must move away from advertising too much and from big billboards. In Ulcin we have a lot of uh, old buildings, old floor, five high buildings, uh, which are from socialist era and we can say they are working still very well and uh, we have some public facilities in, the, uh, in them and yeah, they are made from panels, so really easy to build. Yeah. Wow, it's nice. We can yeah, take yeah, it like, you know, like, smart and go to like, boudoir. Be happy. Yeah, we be can happy. Be. Are you happy not yeah. to be killed by cars? I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, so this is a kindergarten and it has, as you can see, a huge surface area on its roof. Yeah. It can be used for plenty of activities. Yeah, for example, uh, solar panels or some green area, which would uh, uh, make the city more cold. But as we can see, it's really hot. It's here. just taking in the sun. Hi, doggo. Woof woof to you. <laughs> Folks, we found solar panels. <laughs> it's nice. So we have noticed that much like here, next to our shop, also next to our road from the hotel to the shop that we go buy things in, there is a lot of animals that have sadly not survived the trip. We found a beautiful place and near this beautiful place we see lots of trash, unfortunately, and so lots of cars and and yeah, no public transport, as you see. I have found some greens in the wild in this city. <laughs> Therefore, there's a lot of green politics. <laughs> Bye.